Now let's head over to Laurel Staples here in the studio. She's tracking the latest updates on several wildfires in and around western Montana. Laurel. We're keeping tabs on wildfires in Montana and Idaho. First, the coal fire north of Sealy Lake continues to grow in size now at nearly 5,000 acres. The lightning caused fire is burning 15 miles northwest of Sealy Lake. It is 0% contained. Mandatory evacuations and evacuation warnings remain in place for some areas. The fire is pumping out a lot of smoke as it chews through dense timber burning actively on all sides. Crews will continue to secure spot fires on the east flank and burn ground vegetation. On the south side, crews will work to prevent the fire from spreading by building a hand line. On the north side, crews will continue to remove vegetation. From the air, helicopters will continue to drop water on the blaze. Fire behavior is expected to be moderate. Torching and spotting are possible. On the Big Knife Fire, that fire grew overnight. The wildfire is burning five miles east of Arli with an estimated size of 415 acres now up from 200 acres. It is 0% contained. The fire is burning in heavy forest fuels and in steep, rough terrain. Fire activity is expected to increase. Air crews will continue to work on the southwest flank, dumping water on the blaze. No structures are threatened and no evacuations ordered. Officials say lightning sparked the blaze Monday night. The Bulls Creek Fire continues to burn out of control in the Beaverhead Deer Lodge National Forest. The fire grew to over 1,600 acres. The blaze is burning three miles southwest of Scalcaho Pass and scorched over 1,600 acres so far. Fire crews took advantage of today's cooler weather to build fire lines, and smoke is visible in the Bitterroot Valley and Phillipsburg. Another steep increase in the Hayden Fire in Idaho, jumping from 11,000 acres to just over 14,500. Happening right now, a community meeting at the Idaho Fish and Game Office in Salmon. The fire is burning 33 miles south of Salmon, Idaho, and it's burning out of control. Over 600 personnel are on scene as the blaze continues to run through heavy dead and down timber. There is a red flag warning for gusty winds and low relative humidity. Our digital team created a slideshow of the wildfires burning in western Montana and Idaho. To check it out, go to NBCMontana.com. NBC Montana is always working for you to cover wildfires in our area. For complete wildfire coverage throughout the summer, stay with NBC Montana on air. Visit NBCMontana.com for wildfire warnings, maps, evacuation details, and all of the other information you need to stay safe during wildfire season. And be sure to follow us on social media for the very latest updates. In the studio, I'm Laurel Staples for NBC Montana.